Hello, and welcome to TechBoost TV. I'm Jaime, and today I'm going to show you how to install both powered and non-powered video cards into the HP Z640 workstation. Before beginning, we recommend checking with the manufacturer and ensuring the latest firmware is installed. For this installation, you may need a Phillips head screwdriver. We recommend going through this process with the workstation on its side to have better access to the system's interior. Please check out the quick spec link in the description below to learn more about video card compatibility for the HP Z640. To begin, ensure your computer is powered off and the power cord is unplugged. Next, press and hold the power button until the white light is completely shut off. This will ensure there is no residual power remaining on the motherboard. To open the system, lift the latch found on the side. If the latch is locked, please ensure you use the included keys to unlock the panel like so. We highly recommend you check with the manufacturer's system manual and comply with the recommended safety instructions. To install the video card, identify the tabs holding the slot cover retainer in place and remove them by depressing them inward from the back of the system. You can now install the video card. Press firmly down to ensure a proper install. Some cards require power. You can connect up to two power cables to the video card as needed. Once connected, the card is powered. Larger video cards will need a mounting bracket. In order to install the mounting bracket, you will simply mount the bracket to the end of the video card as shown. Ensure to tighten screws all the way. Once finished, install according to the previous instructions, but ensure you also align the bracket with the bracket slot in the computer system. Now you may reattach the panel. Please check out our how-to videos covering processor, memory, hard drive, and video card installation for this and other systems. If you have found this helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below. We welcome suggestions on how to make these more useful, so please don't be shy with requesting additional content. 